Lakewood is an extremely intense community and there's a lot of kids that for whatever reasons are taking their own route. The Mignon is their family. The Mignon is a comfort zone that a person leaves behind whatever he's going through in his life. A lot of the people that come there, I guess, have been wronged or judged probably most of their life. So being able to go to a place where you're not judged by the way you look is a really powerful feeling. They don't try to take people and make them more religious. They just try to show them love. The Minyan was a place that gave you a home away from home. I consider everybody a second father to me. Once you get close to a kid, you never say no. In his head, he finally met someone that's good. You can't let him down. What normally would have taken, and I've been in many programs, four to five years to get a kid from a point of arson, of self-destruct, in under a year, this boy was finishing Masechtas, back in the base Medrash, outgoing, funny, laughing. Him and his father have the greatest relationship. And in my mind, the day I came in, this was the hardest boy I've ever seen in my entire life. What we're striving for is Tara and Hashem, and that's really it. There always has to be a rule of, of learning. I got a chabrusa. The kid can feel comfortable davening and learning in a place where no one else will accept it. You can be anyone here. No one judges you for what you are. And you're in the family. My second home. Everyone has each other's backs here. Through the rabbis, you make a special bond that like doesn't go away. When you meet that and you see the dedication and the love that's outpouring from everybody over here, it's such a shell shock. And once they adjust to it, they're like, wow, I can't survive without this. This is life. This is home. This is what I need. And they never leave.